Reading Pioneers is proud to present Don't Let the Pigeon Drive the Bus Words and Pictures by Mo Willems Hi, I'm the bus driver. Listen, I've got to leave for a little while, so can you watch things for me until I get back? Thanks. Oh, and remember, don't let the pigeon drive the bus. I thought he'd never leave. Hey, can I drive the bus? Please? I'll be careful. I tell you what, I'll just steer. My cousin Herb drives a bus almost every day. True story. Hmm. Vroom, vroom! Vroomy, vroom, vroom! Pigeon at the wheel! No? I never get to do anything. Hey, I've got an idea. Let's play Drive the Bus. I'll go first. Come on! Just once around the block. I'll be your best friend. How about I give you five bucks? No fair. I bet your mom would let me. What's the big deal? It's just a bus. I have dreams, you know. Fine. Let me drive the bus! I'm back. You didn't let the pigeon drive the bus, did you? Great! Thanks a lot! Uh-oh. Bye! Hey! Thank you everyone for reading along with us today to the story, Don't Let the Pigeon Drive the Bus. What did you think? How was the pigeon handling his emotions? I find that this story is very good for many people because it shows the different emotions the pigeon goes through when being told no. And for some people, that can be very difficult growing up. But what are your suggestions and comments about the story? Do you think that the pigeon will be able to drive the fire truck now? If you like this video, click the thumbs up and subscribe to this YouTube channel to see more stories being uploaded every week. Until the next story, here are a couple of other videos that I think you'll enjoy. Well, unfortunately that is all the time we have now. So, until next time, I hope you guys have an amazing day. Bye-bye.